In an age of titans, when giants walked the earth, another kingdom of giants thrived in the shadows of the sea. It was a world of breathtaking beauty and sudden, brutal violence. Here lived a creature of myth, made real by time. Western Interior Seaway, a vast, shallow ocean covering the heart of ancient North America. And this is its queen, a mature female Elasmosaurus. She is an air-breathing reptile, a master of two worlds. But this is where she hunts. Her body, a barrel of muscle, gives her grace and endurance but her true weapon is her neck. Longer than the rest of her body combined, it is a marvel of evolution. Hunting requires patience and precision. Approaching from above, her prey is often unaware of the danger until it is far too late. The shadow of her body masks the silent approach of her head. A sudden serpentine strike and the hunt is successful. For a creature, this large, constant feeding is a necessity. The energy required to move this five-ton body through the water is immense. But energy expended also attracts unwanted attention. In this ocean, there is always a bigger fish, the Mosasaur a true sea monster. It is a creature of pure power and it senses vulnerability. Our plesiosaur is no match for it in a direct confrontation. Her long neck is a critical weakness. Her only defense is awareness and speed. She must retreat to deeper, darker water where the mosasaur is less comfortable. It is a tense retreat into the abyss. Safety is temporary. But today, the escape was for more than just one life. She is heavy with young. Unlike the dinosaurs on land, plesiosaurs give birth to live young here in the water. It is an act of immense vulnerability, a moment when she is at her most exposed. The time has come. A bond is formed. For the next year, the calf will be her entire world. The vast, dangerous ocean is no place for the young and inexperienced. The lessons must be learned quickly. How to hold its breath, how to use its flippers for agility, and most importantly, how to hunt. legacy is secured. The young hunter is learning. Soon it will be large enough to continue the lineage of these magnificent sea dragons. For millions of years, this cycle of life has defined these oceans. They are a testament to the power of adaptation. But even for them, time is running out. Far away, beyond the horizon, a change is coming to the world. A change that not even these masters of the deep will survive. Their world would vanish, but their story, written in stone and fossil, endures. A reminder that for a time, real dragons ruled the waves. <laughs>